Hi, I'm Dr. Richard Olshock. Today I'm going to tell you the real secret of how to hit the ball long and straight. I'm sure after you watch this video, you'll understand completely how the principles of biomechanics and physics accomplish this. For 10 years, I've been using biomechanics to simplify the golf swing. Now you're going to see the best swing aid ever invented. It'll simplify your golf swing and you'll hit it longer and straighter. I don't care if you're a beginner or a tour professional, you'll get better. So this is one of my new students, Don. Uh, the other day we were on the driving range and uh, he was standing next to one of my top players and we were also going to play a round of golf with my partner who's a PGA professional and hits it a long way. So I was, this is the first time I'd seen Don swing a golf club and I thought, well, I better give Don a little tip so it'd get a little better uh, once we uh, get out on the golf course. So I gave him a, a quick lesson and uh, we used the uh, pro swing band uh, just for five minutes. And uh, we got out on the golf course and we got to the third hole, which is a par five. And uh, tell us what happened, Don. Well, we all hit our tee shots and uh, we all hit very nice tee shots. And we walked down there and I went to the first ball and looked down and noticed that it was, it was the pro's ball. And we found my ball, and that was well over 300 yards. And uh, we happened to find mine about at least 10 yards ahead of, ahead of the professional. So uh, I hadn't hit a golf ball like that that far in a long, long time, Doc. And that continued the rest of the round, and it's continued it, ever since. It uh, did. One of our friends was away on a trip. He came back, and all of a sudden, uh, you were hitting it past him, and he used yeah. to, to hit it about 30 yards past you. Yes. And so... This pro swing band, I think, works pretty well. Uh, and I heard that you were so excited after that first round how your golf swing had changed so much that you couldn't even sleep. Well, Doc, I've had a lot of uh, very good, I thought at the time, uh, professional teaching over the years. And I've never had anything that's helped me as quickly as, as Doc's pro swing band and your teaching. Well, thank you for that. And so we're going to... We're going to look and see what the Pro Swing Band can do for you. When you're watching golf on TV, the swings that you're seeing are really an illusion. What you'll learn from using the Swing Band is that the hands go out away from you on the backswing and they come close to you on the downswing. But when you look at it, the hands look like they start further away and at the top of the backswing, they've come closer to you. They're over the shoulder now. But it's really the turn that makes it look like the hands have gotten closer to you while they've really gotten further away. On the downswing, it looks like your hands are getting further away from you, but it's really the left shoulder that's opening up to square up at impact that causes this illusion. The hands are really getting closer. If we looked at the golf swing without a turn, it would look like this. The hands go out, they come back in. Let's look at a few pictures of Don and see why he was able to hit it 40 yards further, and you'll be able to hit it further too. This is Don's old swing. His left arm has come across his chest and it has severely restricted the radius of his swing. Now you see Don using the swing band and his radius has increased markedly. The golf swing is really a circle and the circumference of the circle determines how far the ball is going to go. Within minutes of using the swing band, Don created a much wider radius. This led to him gaining 40 yards off the tee. Distance isn't some magical thing. It really depends on physics and science. If you can remember from grade school geometry, this is the equation for the circumference of a circle. When we look at the radius of each swing and plug it into an equation, you can see why Don is hitting it much further. He has made the circumference of the circle about 35% bigger. Let me give you the instructions for using the swing band so you can hit it further as well. In the box, you'll find the chest strap and four bands. The bands are of different strengths and they have various uses. If you're a stronger person, you'll use the blue band and the black band. 
The black band is for doing drills without hitting balls and the blue band is for hitting balls. If you're a young person or you're not very strong, you'll use the orange band and the green band. The orange band is for doing drills and the green band is for actually hitting balls. The green band, it can be used in a very young person to do drills and hit balls. It can be used by everybody to work on pitch shots. Take the band that you're going to use and put it on the strap and then put the strap behind your back. Put it just about chest high right where your sternum is and cinch it very, very tightly. It should be just to the left of the center. Don actually takes two bands that he's going to use and puts it on the strap. Then the strap goes chest high. He cinches it very tightly. When you have two of them on there, you don't have to keep switching back and forth between drills and hitting balls. Once the swing band is on, you're going to put your left thumb through the band. Then you'll take your normal grip. You notice I had to use a hickory shafted club. I can't afford that new technology. The first drill will teach you how your arms work. In this drill, we're going to lift, but we aren't going to turn. Lift, stretch the band, and your hand should end up opposite your right shoulder and just slightly above your right shoulder. Repeat this drill 15 times and then take the band off and lift the club. You can see that he has created a very wide radius. This is the object of the drill. This is where the hands and the club should be at the top of your lift. When you look at it from behind, you can see how the hands get further away and then they come back close. This is what actually happens in the golf swing. When you come back down, try to keep the radius extended as long as you can. Maintaining this radius is what will create consistency in your golf swing. You can see the path of the hands as they come back in. They maintain a nice wide radius. The next drill puts the lift and the turn together. Don lifts and then he turns. He also takes a nice low takeaway for a few inches and then he lifts and then he turns and he's in perfect position at the top of the backswing. Do at least 15 of these. Next, Gus puts the lift and the turn together into one motion. You can see he's in perfect position at the top of the backswing and the radius is nice and wide. Don will demonstrate the next drill and it's actually all the parts of the golf swing. First, he takes his nice low takeaway, then he lifts, turns, comes back down to delivery, and goes to post impact. And you can see how he extends the band after impact. This is also an important part of the swing. It allows the arc to stay nice and wide. It also allows him to have great arm extension through impact. In the next drill, Gus is actually hitting balls and he's trying to maintain the extension at post impact. I think you can see this clearly. Watch the extension after impact. Now Gus will take the band off and hit some balls and see if he can reproduce what he felt with the band. As you can see, mission accomplished. He has nice arm extension all the way after impact and this maintains the circumference of the circle. This is Brian, a high handicapper who has problems with his intermediate wedge shots. This one's about 60 yards and he's using the green band which has really helped him a lot. The radius creates consistency. I made the swing band very compact and it's also very light so you can carry it in your bag. You can also use it indoors during the winter to really improve your swing. Here's how the swing band is going to help your swing. Maximize the radius and you'll maximize distance. It simplifies the golf swing, gives you consistency, 
and resistance training is much faster learning. I hope the Pro Swing Band helps you enjoy your game as much as it's helped Don enjoy his. Have fun. If you want one, go to Amazon.com and type in Pro Swing Band.